I could have left the other car sketch. <laughs> All right, guys, so uh, I kind of want to hit on a, a few topics here. Um, number one is if you would like your car featured on uh, this channel, definitely let me know. Uh, I love doing that. I love showing off um, other cars um, that are on other channels. The only thing that um, is really needed is if I go to your channel, uh, I can only create videos that have the proper footage um usually to make like a really cool video which is what you've seen lately like the viper video the dodge magnum video um is you want a uh like a, a tour of the car like a nice slow walk around or some really cool angles of uh the exterior of the car and then you're, you know, you're looking for exhaust clips, flybys, um, you know, just interesting footage to show off how the car sounds and, and stuff like that. But if you have that kind of footage on your channel or you're willing to upload that kind of footage, I can grab it, make a cool little video. And then what I do is I put your channel in the description and then um, ask you to uh, comment on the video and then I pin it and then you can list out the modifications you've done and kind of bring awareness to your car and I have no problem doing that I find it very enjoyable to do that and to me it's it's fun as heck piecing together the those kinds of videos um, I enjoy it and I think it's it's a lot of fun um, for people to view this kind of stuff because uh, it mixes it up, you know. Um, I myself love my car. I love, I love the blue charger, but I also enjoy looking at other cars as well. So uh, it adds a little flavor to the channel. And if you don't mind me uh, making a, a video of your car, it can certainly help bring awareness to your channel. So um, yeah, if you're interested in that, definitely let me know. Now the other topic is the the um, the boxes that I ordered uh, online have now arrived at my house. So I am really really hoping over the weekend that I have beautiful weather for installation. The styling that I'm going to do requires a really nice day, and I am going to be extremely patient with the installation. My lovely wife has offered to film me, which is very rare uh, when I do an install that I have a camera person, so I can't ever really do a proper install video. So for this, I am really hoping that I get a good install video, and this way if anybody decides that they wanna do it, well, they'll know how to do it. So uh, I'm pretty pumped about that. I can't wait to to get this this certain modification on there now it's not performance related it's styling but it's a big styling uh upgrade and one that i've been thinking about doing for quite a while and i'm glad that the day has come where i can uh, do it it's going to be a big focal point on this car and a very in your face kind of um you know modification so that is hoping, I'm hoping is going to happen this weekend. Uh, the other one was the front plate and we're going to test that out hopefully over the weekend as well. And then I got an up, uh, an update on my catch can and that should be around in three weeks or so. So I don't know, I'm not holding my breath on that. So, uh, those are the three things that I ordered, um, and the updates on them. Just know that two of them are in my possession and it's a matter of carving out some time and hoping that the weather holds up so that I can actually piece together some, some good footage to upload. Um, 
the uh, the last thing I kind of wanted to talk about is highlighting something, a milestone of this cha uh, the, the channel and thanking you guys for continuously supporting this channel. The channel has reached 500,000 views. That's unbelievable. Um, that's a half a million views in about six months. And really, the people that that continue viewing and commenting and everything like that, guys, I really do appreciate it. You know, I'm not just BSing when I put it in the comments like, hey, I really appreciate it. I really do appreciate the support. It really means a ton to me. I've never been a part of something like this in my life. And it's a ton of fun to um, watch the channel grow, interact with you guys you know, um, in the Mopar community. I love being a part of it. I love interacting with um, uh, all of you guys. And I, I just find this stuff just so fun and entertaining. And um, I look forward to each day uploading a video and just, you know, bullshitting with a bunch of you guys, you know. So there it is. This is a, it's going to be a good weekend. And I'm hoping that, um, more specifically, I get my styling modification done because it's something that I've been looking forward to for a while now, and I finally ordered it. I finally am ready for it, and uh, I hope it's something that um, goes on easily and looks dynamite. You know, in my sometimes when you when you have something in your brain or you think that something is is what you want, and then you see it in person, you're like, nah. I'm hoping that is not the case. I'm hoping that as much as I love it, like in theory and what I've seen on other cars, when I see it on my car, I'm hoping that I absolutely love it. So we're going to see. It should be a good weekend. And that's that. One of the biggest reasons why I created this channel and why I found motivation early on to make this channel, I was reminded of last night or yesterday. I was watching a video and a, a person was reviewing a Challenger TA and it had the 5.7 liter. And basically, they dogged the 5.7 liter uh, and put the 392 on this pedestal. And I don't hate the 392 engine, nor do I hate the owners in the 392. What I don't like is how, how many people shit on the RT and the 5.7 liter. And that's why I found it so important to create a channel that highlights how good these cars are. Because so many people put out bullshit and don't know what the hell they're talking about. They don't know how to drive the damn thing. I watched the freaking car, you know, the guy. It, it's not just that one guy. It's the fact that there's so many people out there that create this this bullshit image about the cars that we're driving and it needs to be adjusted, corrected and shown that these things are freaking fun and they're just, they're not shit. 